Hello, this is Chris from Polytech, and in this video, we are going to learn how to add floating effects and customize them a bit to the elements of our site using the Elementor page builder and the Happy Add ons for Elementor plugin. To do that, we need to go over to the left where it says plugins. We are going to click on our new, and on the plugin search bar, we are going to type Happy Add ons. And this is the one we are going to use, happy add-ons for Elemental, with add some extra widgets to our site among them, the one we are going to use. We click on install now, then on activate. Once that is done, we are going to the top name of the site and we are going to click on visit site. There we go. Now on the top, we are going to click on edit with Elemental. There we go. Now for the example we have added a button here, we are going to click on edit and we are going to move to the advanced option. This can be done with any element you want and we are going to click on the floating effects. We are going to click on enable and now we have a few options to choose. We can translate rotate or scale the element so we are going to click here and now we have a few options we have the axis we want for the element to move on the duration and the delay between the animations so now as you can see we have a 5px down on the Y axis and on the X axis. And if we move this, for example, zero, it will only move downwards. And if we move, for example, this one to minus 5px, it will move up and down. And we can do so in a combination that we want, for example, move between certain parts or as you can see between quite the distance can be green as well so we are going to settle with 5px 5 minus px and 5px on the x axis and as well for the y axis so it's moving between a diagonal and the duration it's one second it can be moved as you can see and made slower or faster as you need so we are going to go with a second and a half and we are going to add a second of delay between the two movements as you can see it moves waits for a second and then goes again and this can be done between various of the effects we can also make it rotate on the x y and the set axis duration delay as well and it can be scaled also in the same manner x y it works mostly the same duration and delay between the animations. So we can experiment and try different combinations to see which one works better for what we want to do on the site. Once we have set the effect as we want it, we need to go to the lower left and click on the update button. So that's it. We have learned how to add floating effects and customize them a bit for the elements of our site using the Elementor page builder and the happy add-ons for Elementor plugin in a quick and easy manner. If you like this video, subscribe to our channel and share with a friend who might help on the site. See you the next time on Paladec.